Holy Cross took another step toward defending its Patriot League title with a 55-27 win at Bucknell in Week 6. The FCS leader in rushing touchdowns, Jordan Fuller, ran for another four scores to push his season total to 13. He rushed for 147 of Holy Cross's 316 yards in the Crusaders' second league win of 2023. Hi, I'm Maria Tribal Peace in the Patriot League studio. Holy Cross's offense is ranked fourth in the FCS and averaging 41.5 points per game, but our focus this week shifts to one of the FCS top defenses in Lafayette. The Leopards recorded another seven sacks on Saturday, and they lead the FCS with 27 and four and a half per game. The Lafayette defense held Princeton scoreless over the final three quarters, and the seventh and final sack was a safety with 157 left to close out the 12-9 win, Lafayette's first over Princeton since 2003. The eventual game-winning score came right before halftime as Dean DeNoble tossed a 15-yard touchdown pass to Mason Gilbert with 26 seconds left to take the 10-9 lead into the break. Lafayette has now won all five games against FCS opponents in 2023, and they get the week off to prepare for their big Week 8 matchup against Holy Cross. Georgetown and Lehigh will kick off at 1 p.m. in the lone Patriot League contest of Week 7, while Colgate hosts Dartmouth and Bucknell travels to Cornell. Fordham heads to Stony Brook for a 3.30 p.m. kick after an exciting league win in Week 6. Lehigh jumped out to an early 21-7 lead, but the Rams rallied behind Julius Luffridge's 170 yards and two touchdowns to take a 24-21 lead in the third quarter. After back-to-back -back Lehigh scores, C.J. Montez threw his FCS-leading 17th touchdown pass to cut it to three midway through the fourth. Kicker Brandon Peskin tied the game with a 42-yard field goal with 154 left, and with no time left on the clock, Peskin earned the FedEx Crown FCS National Special Teams Player of the Week award with a game-winning 45-yard field goal. Luffridge's big day moved him into the FCS Top 15 in rushing with 569 yards on the season. He joins fellow Patriot Leaguers Matt Sluka, Jordan Fuller, and Jamar Curtis on the list, with Curtis's 698 rushing yards leading the way at number 5. Catch all the early games this Saturday on ESPN Plus, and follow us on social at Patriot League TV for all the highlights. I'll see you back here next week.